Today on Cooking E Keto, we're gonna make the chaffle. So today's a really exciting day. Everywhere I've been looking lately on the internet, all I see are chaffle this and chaffle that and chaffle, chaffle, chaffle. So many different kinds of chaffles. So I was like, I really need to try one of these. I was surprised when I had ordered the uh, Dash Mini Waffle Maker. It's about this big, uh, but it was on back order everywhere and it was not gonna come for a couple of weeks from Amazon. And then today I woke up and my Alexa told me I had a package coming and I was like, what's coming? I didn't order anything. And Alexa said, you got your Dash Waffle Maker coming. I was like, oh great. And she said nine o'clock at night. And I was like, oh great. You know, we got here like three o'clock in the afternoon. So we're gonna do Cook and Eat Keto's first ever unboxing. And we're gonna taste and eat our first chuffle bonus package. It came in a Taylor Swift box from Amazon. This is gonna be a good day. All right, it's our Cook and Eat Keto's first ever unboxing. If you're new to the channel, this is where we cook keto recipes and eat keto recipes. And this is, I'm not an expert, really barely even know how to cook. And I just am a guy who's trying, ooh, who's trying to eat, learn how to eat keto. And I find it complicated. I don't think I need that anymore. So, anyway, um, like and subscribe, yeah. So, Mini Dash, the Mini Waffle Maker. Nice box, very rigid, it's good cardboard. This is some good cardboard in this box. So, it's got the easy open pull tab. Little disappointed there's not one of those little round sticker things there. That would have been a nice touch, but that's okay. This is under $10, so I guess if they added the sticker that would have Cost some more. Uh, open it up. Uh, first look in. I see. Oh, there's some good tape. Uh, oh, I guess someone wants to slide it out. I guess. Ow, that's not a pleasant sound. Oh, there is. Looks like we have the dash. Actual. Waffle maker. It looks like this is some sort of a instruction booklet. Very good design on this. I love the the uh, flip top with the instructions. This is going to be a nice place to put this in my junk drawer to hold this, so I don't lose all of this stuff. We will take out. Oh, prepare for the chaffle. This ought to be fun. So in case if you don't know what a chaffle is, a chaffle is basically a cheese and egg waffle. These are the only two ingredients in our basic chaffle. And everyone says that these are basically, um, it's a wonderful invention and whoever invented it is like the savior of keto. It's like the best thing since <laughs> sliced bread to the people who eat keto. Uh, Cause it's supposed to have the consistency of sort of a bread or waffle kind of thing. And people are using them with hamburger buns and hot dogs and I guess hot dogs. Uh, people are making them sweet, people are making them savory. But this, this is the basic chaffle. One egg, half a cup mozzarella cheese. So we're gonna combine these two here into a bowl and just Mix them together. Just like this. And while the instructions for the chuffle basically say that, or the, or the waffle, are basically to cook it like three to four minutes, the chuffles are kind of overcooked. They're cooked for five, six, seven, eight, nine minutes to get them 
crispy. And one basic chaffle recipe of the one egg and a half cup of mozzarella cheese should make two chaffles. All right. I'm not gonna add salt, pepper, nothing. We're just going to, I've got my little waffle iron preheating here and yeah, that's kind of warm. So we're going to pour about half of this mixture in. About roughly half. Spread it around a little bit. Oof. All right. Let's see how that works. Okay, we're right at six minutes and we're gonna see how well the chuffle turned out. Timer. All right, let's see here. Oh, crispy. Hmm. Ow. Now, I've seen people grease the, these little, oh, that looks nice. I've seen people like spray some sort of a cooking spray on there, but that just, I mean, obviously that came out really easy. It is kind of hot. <laughs> oh, chuffle number one, probably. Hmm. So while this was cooking, there was like a distinct a smell of uh, like burnt egg. Uh, let's make the second chuffle. See if I got my ratios right. Eh, first one might have been a little bit bigger than the second. So yeah, each one's supposed to make two chuffles. This is probably looking to be more like the right amount to put in as opposed to that one because this one each eked over the edge a little. Oof. Let's do that for six minutes and see how that works out. All right, everybody, I've been sitting here for six minutes staring at this truffle, so let's count it down together. Five, four, three, two, one. Truffle. Yeah, it just was like the whole time this thing was, ooh. The whole time this one was cooking, I was staring at that one like, I want to eat that one. And um, I didn't. Look, I got something that'll burn my hand this time. Preparation, six minutes. Oh, wow, look at that. That's. That's solid. That's pretty. I think that this amount was, maybe this one's a little bit too much because this one seems a little bit, I'm just playing my food, sorry. Awesome. Let's eat the chaffle. Now it's time for the taste test. I have the chaffle. Well, my first impressions are, it feels like a regular waffle, like I said earlier, like an ego. Uh, so let's just go right ahead. Good crunch. Mm, definitely could replace bread in a lot of ways. I definitely think if you add a lot of different things to it, you can make it better, like a, a jalapeno cheddar would be probably really good. I might have to try that. Um, I could use this for a sandwich. I could use this for Ooh, grilled cheese. I bet this will make a good grilled cheese. I'll just try to grilled cheese later. Um, so yeah. This is really good. Taste, um, kind of like a little bit of a, like a French toast taste, uh, kind of buttery. I just guess just from the oils from the cheese getting everywhere because I didn't put any spray or any butter or anything. Um, so yeah. Today uh, on Cook and Eat Keto, we did our first unboxing. We made our first chaffle, and we learned two things. Chaffle, a lot of potential. Very impressed with the ease of the chaffle. Love the dash mini waffle iron. Second thing we learned, Taylor Swift's new album, Love, 
can be heard on Amazon Music. So extra bonus for you there. Thanks. Join us next time on Cooking Eat Keto. Hmm, truffle. <laughs>